In terms of measurement, we'll discuss four main aspects. First, metric progression. Second, factor labeling. Third, scientific notation. And fourth, accuracy and precision. We only use the metric system in science because it's based on multiples of 10. It's simple to use and it's consistent, whereas the English system is not. There are no fractions. One must only move the decimal to the right to increase a measurement or to the left to decrease a measurement. We also can change the exponent and the number. In the metric system, grams is the only unit for mass. Liters is the only unit for volume. Meters, the only unit for distance. Kelvin, the unit for temperature, although we use Celsius degrees in daily life. Factor labeling is uh, also called dimensional analysis. It's simply to change from one unit to another, so we'll learn how to do that, and it keeps the quantity of the measurement the same. This is done virtually by everyone all the time. For instance, when we exchange four quarters for a dollar, we are factor labeling. Here's the metric progression that we need to learn, which you can see if you start at the bottom, pico, nano, micro, those all go by multiples of a thousand, but then from milli, centi, deci, the standard, deca, hecta, kilo, those all go by tens, and then again you skip to mega, giga, and tera, which also go by a thousand. The last two aspects are scientific notation and what we call uncertainty, where we use significant figures. Scientific notation is the formal written language of measurement that the entire world uses to express consistently measurements with a number and a unit. The number has to be greater than 1 and less than 10, so usually between 1 and 9. And also there is an exponent or a power of 10 associated with it. This is where, like factor labeling, we will use what's called the thumbs up, thumbs down rule. Why should we be precise? Accuracy and precision are critical components of measurement, so we use significant figures and percent error in science to indicate how close a measurement is to an accepted value and to indicate how many decimal places a measurement should be written in.